I tweeted this, CS2 investment check, okay? And this was kind of like a joke, because I had tweeted this one before. I am the Butterfly Emerald Monopoly Man. When I had six Butterfly Emeralds, I ended up getting one more, so I tweeted CS2 investment check. I'm gonna be honest, I never really thought of this as an investment. I just happened to have this many at the same time. Because I buy and sell a lot of skins. If someone comes to me tomorrow and says, hello, I have a Ursus Tiger Tooth, then you know, okay, if you wants to sell it, I'll buy it. Then if another guy comes, hello, I'll have uh, Ursus Tiger Tooth, and I'll buy it again. And then someone comes, hello, I have three Ursus Tiger Tooth, and I just happen to accidentally end up with a lot of skins. That's how I happen to end up with a lot of these. But I am very, very lucky. When I bought these, they were $19,000 each. You want to know what they're worth now? <laughs> Gamma. They are now going for $13,000. That means every single butterfly emerald went down $6,000. As you may notice, I said I have seven. One is 0 0.00 and one was stat track. But for the sake of easy, I'm just not gonna take that into consideration. If I kept these, I would have lost $42,000. But ladies and gentlemen, you are talking to Fat Warren Buffett. I realize when CS came out, people are not going to come and buy skins as much as they have before. I gotta sell these. I insta tried to sell as many as I could. I ended up selling all of them for plus minus zero. I didn't profit anything, but I didn't lose anything. I am so happy about that. If I held on to them and I was just like, oh, diamond hands, hold it, hold it, hold it, I would have been down 42,000. Now, my friend Drips, he, just like me, had an investment. Hopefully, my Count Strike 2 investment will be successful. Now, as I said, my investment was more of a coincidence, and I thought, eh, I might as well tweet it, you know, and call it an investment. That's kind of fun. He actually still has this. 15 M4 Howl FM. This is an absolutely crazy screenshot. Having this many contraband M4 Howl is insane. For those of you that don't know, I think he said he put in like a hundred thousand dollars or something or more. He ended up actually buying one more and has 16. I'm not trying to make fun of him, and he knows that because he tweets about it as well. But do you guys know how much that is right now? Minus 20k, bro. Honestly, to be honest, if I held mine, I would have been minus double him. So he actually isn't too bad considering how versus the Butterfly Emerald, how the prices went. But yeah, he is holding them for investment purposes, which I respect. But yeah, it can't be easy being down that much on skins. I have never really been down that much on skins. I'm down now, like I said, maybe 15, 20,000, but that's across my whole inventory. This is the definition of not putting all your eggs in one one basket when investing. True. But to be honest, he probably would have still lost about the same even if he put it in other skins. Maybe even more. Everyone lost a lot these past couple months. But now, prices have slowly started to turn green. Hey. Kinda cool. It's nice. The skins go down in price. More accessible to people who genuinely enjoy the game. Bro, I'm gonna be honest. I'm sounding like a boomer. When I played CS when it was released, I was buying skins. And the way I did it was in Sweden, you get money for going to school. And I was going to university. So I was getting like $200 per month or something. I spent that on skins. That's how I afforded skins in the beginning. But I am wondering, nowadays, who the fuck is waking up one morning and buying like a uh, butterfly lore, right? Who affords that? Even if you have a job, it's so much money. Look, this is a butterfly lore. This one has already gone down so much in value. It's still $2,000. When I was buying my own skins, I'm seeing it from my point of view. If I had like two. 200, 300 dollars in a month, I could buy hella skins. Back in that time, a Bayonet Vanilla was like 70 euro. Flip Vanilla was like 50. Karambit Vanilla was like maybe 100 or 150 or something. Yeah, it's fucked up for people who just want to have their dream skin. Yeah, it's become such a rich man's game having skins. I remember Butterfly when it was released, you could get one for easily like 100 euro.